she beaming, I be booming down that block. Down that block. Everywhere you go, you know they know I'm hot. What's up? What's going on, my good people? Welcome back to the channel. Hope you all are doing well. I'm gonna go ahead and jump right into this video. Well, I'm gonna get into the vlog in a couple of minutes. I wanna give a big shout out and a big thank you to Timu for sponsoring today's video. I'm about to go ahead and open this pack. I'm trying to make sure y'all can see it. I'm about to go ahead and open this package and show you all the goodies that I got. Um, so while I'm opening this package, I wanna share some of my favorite things about Timu. First of all, they offer everything. They have everything and it's super affordable. One of my other favorite things about it is that they have free shipping. Free shipping is a game changer as far as I'm concerned because let me tell you, I cannot tell you how many carts I've walked away from because the shipping ended up being more than the products that I was purchasing, you know? So I'm like, no. So free shipping, love it. I'm here for it. All right, so there's that. They have a ton of options. I got a bunch of stuff um, for my home. And I, you know, I got practical things, things that I have forgot about, things that I hadn't thought about. But like I said, when I was on their website, just browsing through, I'm like, they got everything. So I'm gonna show you some of the things that I picked up. All right, let's start here. Okay, so this is a very practical thing for me, y'all. These are shower caps. Now I don't know about you, but when when I have my wash days, I have to have a shower cap, especially when I'm deep conditioning my hair. When I'm deep conditioning my hair, I need a shower cap so that I can dry my hair. I sit under the dryer for about 20 minutes, so I need this. So, y'all look at how many, look at all of these shower caps. So, I got this from my office slash guest room. So, it says F.A., a little bit of crazy, M.I., a little bit loud, L.Y., and a whole lot of love. So I'm gonna frame these and I wanna put these on my wall. It says family. So I love that. That caught my attention immediately because I mean, I you know, especially being so far away from my family, like I'm just thinking about little things that I can have around my apartment that makes me think about my family. And it's gonna be in my guest room slash office where I spend a lot of time getting work done. So I'm gonna look up and probably just start laughing and thinking about different things. So that is actually one of my favorite things that I got off of their website. All right, so next up is this. It's a cup brush with a long handle. I don't know about y'all, but I love to drink my water or like my tea. I love drinking it out of bottles. And when I do, I want to make sure that it's clean. So when I saw this on the website, I'm like, oh, I got to have this because I didn't have one. And like I said, I like to make sure that my bottles are clean before I use them. So cut brush with a long handle. Now on to the next thing. Now, I never thought under any circumstance that I would have one of these, but an auto shut off cup warmer. Now that I'm a coffee girl, I'm drinking coffee every single morning, y'all. Whenever you see me in my office in the morning, I have coffee. And I'm going to tell you, it's a first world problem, but I'll be like, dang, my coffee is cold. Now I got to go warm it up. Now I can stop doing that. Boom. Perfect. And the auto shut off feature. <laughs> yes, I need that. I need y'all to give me a pass for this next thing I'm going to show you. I should have had one of these a long time ago. And because I never had one, I got a couple of them. All right. So I got these. These are like the little taco holders. When you see people eating, doing their eating videos and stuff, that it keeps the taco up. I should have been had this. I got these kind, and I also got the silver looking one as well. Can you see that? Let me take it out of the package so you can see what I'm talking about. I should have been had this. I can't believe that I've never had, um, I can't believe that I've never had one of these, you know? And I wanted to get a couple of them because you know, just in case somebody else is in a video with me, they might be eating along with me and we can make sure that their tacos are sitting up the right way as well. All right, so here we go. Y'all, why did I have one of these? I should have been had this and you know how much I love tacos. So definitely gonna see this. You're gonna see this for sure on the channel. These are getting put to use. I'm so excited, y'all. All right, okay. When I show you this next thing, this is really proof that Timu has everything. This thing is so important to my wash day routine. So I need my shower caps because once I put my deep conditioner in my hair, I like to have a shower cap on before I go into the dryer. Y'all, a bonnet dryer attachment. Y'all have seen me use this a few times, but I left mine in California. So when I saw this, I wasn't expecting to see it on the Timu website, but when I saw it, I had to have it because I need it. And I'm about to have a wash day very soon. So tell y'all, get one of these. All right, next up are some kitchen shears. I got some kitchen shears. These are good for like poultry, fish, if you're cutting herbs. But these are great quality. And they have that safety guard right here. So if you push that back, push the latch back, you're able to use them. So you can hear that. And I wanted these because I have a pair of shears 
with my knife set, but I'm like, I didn't want to use that all the time. I wanted something dedicated just to like the stuff that I have to cut in the kitchen. So now I have me some kitchen shears. Okay, I'm gonna show the next two things together because they will be used in the kitchen. I got a whisk. When I saw it on the website, I realized I didn't have one. So I got a whisk and a brush to wash dishes. And I love these kind of brushes because you can just unscrew the bottom and add in the dishwashing liquid and it makes things a lot easier. So love this. This next thing, I wanna hang it up as soon as this video is over. I got some wall decor. Now I'm gonna take this out so you can see it cause you can't really see it and I need y'all to see it. So give me one second, I'll be right back. It's three of them. I'm gonna show you all three, be right back. This is just one order. So in one order, you get three of them, okay? So I'm gonna show you all three and each one of them, they come with the nails and everything you need to hang it up on your wall. All right, tell me this is not dope. Tell me, tell me it's not dope, y'all. That's one. This is two. You see that? This is two. And the third one, y'all, look at this. Y'all see the hands, the lips? I'm telling you, when I got to the wall decor section, I was really, really impressed. So I got that for wall decor. And remember, I also got the other thing earlier that said family. So I mean, I just got stuff everywhere. I'm excited because I'm gonna be able to use all of these things. Cause again, they're all very practical things that I got. Um, great quality. And you're gonna see a lot of this stuff when I do the finished apartment tour. You're gonna see it cause it's like the finishing touches for me, you know? Um, so I'm excited. So again, go ahead and check the description box out. Go ahead and use my code. Take that extra 30% off. When you go on the website, you're already going to be blown away about the prices because it's like up to 90% off. So make sure you check out the Timu website. I'm telling you, they got you covered. If you need something for your living room, for your office, um, your kitchen, your bedroom, your dining room, whatever, they got you covered. So type whatever you're looking for in the search box and take advantage of these low prices. And don't forget to get the extra 30% off by using my code. I will put it here on the screen, but it's also in the description box. And I will even put it in the pinned comments because I want y'all to get that extra savings, all right? So thank you, Timu, for sponsoring this video. I'm gonna go ahead and jump into the vlog. What's up? What's going on, my good people? Welcome back to the channel. Hope you all are doing well. If this is your first time here, I would like to say welcome. If you are a returning member of the GP fam, I want to say welcome back. Today is Thursday, May 4th. It's about 4.45 p.m. Um, and it's been a full day. It's been a nice, full, busy day. Um, I recorded a video earlier. I packaged up some orders. I'm about to get ready to package some more orders. Um, so yeah, I took a quick break so I could start a vlog. Um, cause I got some things going on and I want to bring y'all along with me. Um, let's see. So tomorrow I am going to see my therapist for the first time in person. I've been going to her since October, November of last year and everything has been virtual, but I told her once I got settled in that I would actually come see her in person. So I'm going to see my therapist tomorrow. So I want to bring y'all along to talk, you know, like, I want to talk and check in with y'all before I go into my session and then check in with y'all when, you know, when I'm out of the session. So that uh, finally going to at home to get these throw pillows. Um, like I said, at some point, you'll see me working and doing orders. Also, what's going to be in this video, I'm preparing for my my furnished apartment tour. Um, I might be replanting, like repotting a plant. I need to put it in the pot that I bought for it. And I have been putting that off for like two weeks now. So I need to do that. So yeah, there's some things going on. So I wanted to make sure that I bring y'all along with me. Um, one thing I want to share right now is I am looking at something. These things have become my favorite things in my apartment. So I want to show it to you real quick. So TaskRabbit came to my apartment yesterday, did a couple things for me. I got three um, floating shelves hung like in the hallway. I had no idea what I was putting on these shelves, y'all, but it all worked out. So let me show you what it looks like. This is my favorite thing in my apartment right now. So one second. So I always go back and forth about what's my favorite thing in my apartment. But right now it is these floating shelves, hands down. Very simple, but they really add a lot to the space. They add a lot to the space to me. Um, 
and I wasn't sure what I was going to put on the shelves. I had no idea, but I knew I wanted to display this artwork. Shout out to Sheena. This is actually um, a gift. The artwork is a gift from my registry for my housewarming. And it's actually a six pack of art. So I'll just be rotating the other three um, pieces of art. I'll rotate them in at some point. So, yeah. And this pineapple, I am so glad that I found a place for it. Because it's been in my bedroom, it's been on my bar cart, and I finally found a home for it up here. These um, frames are $1.25 frames from Dollar Tree. And I don't know if I mentioned it, the artwork came from Amazon. Just a candle that I got from Walmart. And it's my still my favorite candle right now. And this bottle of Tempranillo. So we got this bottle from Cooper's Hawk. And I was like, you know, once we finished the bottle... I just love the color because I have so much like orange in my apartment. So I held on to it and didn't know what I was going to do with it. And once these shells went up, I was like, oh, I know exactly what I'm doing with it. And I had some leftover um, grass decor. So I added that in. And I love with these shelves too. The shelves came from Amazon. With these shelves, I love that, you know, it can go up. And then I chose to have this pointing down. So I think it looks good like that in the middle and having the two going up on the side so yeah it's like my favorite thing in the apartment like i love when i got like if i'm walking back and forth or going to my bedroom when i'm leaving out of the kitchen i love passing by this i really do What's up, y'all? Today is Friday, May 5th. It is about 1.30 in the afternoon. Um, I just left my therapy appointment and I just pulled into the parking lot. I am finally at home, made my way here so I could check out their throw pillows. Um, you know what's funny is that I actually recorded when I first pulled up to my therapist's office, but the audio went out, so that's cool. But y'all, I was so excited to see my therapist. You should have seen how, like we were smiling from ear to ear. We hugged each other. And it was just really nice to see her in person, like really, really nice after all these months. So it was good, like feeling her energy in person and all that good stuff. So I really enjoyed that. I think I'm going to mix it up. Um, I'll have some virtual sessions and I'll also go in person. So I'll go back and forth. Um, but yeah, like, man, it was a good session. One thing I had to address was that I am experiencing sleep anxiety. Um, I was curious if I was going to have problems with this and I am having some issues and it took a while for me to discover it because um, my mom was here for 30 days. And when I say sleep anxiety, I mean that I'm having a hard time sleeping alone because I haven't slept alone with like no one, you know, under the same roof for four and a half years. So, you know, I've lived alone for years, like years and years and years. It's just I haven't lived alone for four and a half years. So I've just gotten used to somebody being present, you know, under the same roof as me. And yeah, I didn't realize it was an issue because my mom was in town for like a month. And then, you know, I've seen my honey quite a bit. So she stayed with me. I've been at her place. So yeah, y'all, the other night I had this nightmare, jumped up out of my sleep. I was frantic. Um, yeah, I had a really hard time sleeping and I just didn't like that feeling. So I'm not, I didn't want to sit on it for weeks and weeks and weeks. I wanted to address it with my therapist as soon as possible. So we talked about it. And the thing I'm gonna work on right now is implementing a night routine. So I've, I've always had like a morning routine. I've always been more focused on the morning routine, but I've never had like a night routine. So I'm gonna try a couple different things out to see how that works. So like I said, I was curious, like as I was preparing to move, I was wondering if I would struggle like sleeping alone and sure enough i'm having some issues with it so i'm hoping that the routine helps and um i'll just be checking in with her uh to discuss things and and see what kind of adjustments i have to make so i'll keep y'all posted on that but um yeah so i'm here i'm at home they have so many options when it comes to throw pillows so i'm excited about going in here and see if i can find something that works um that i need to get for my day bed so I'll bring y'all along with me. Let's go.
I got my pillows, y'all. I got my pillows. I'm going to show you the ones I actually chose. Um, if you're looking for decorative pillows, I'm telling you, at home is the place to check out. If you have one in your area, you should 100% go. Um, because it's just rows and rows of options. So um, I'm glad that I had things to choose from, you know? You know how it is when you end up kind of like having to settle because you it's just really scarce. So yeah, they had options and I'm happy about that. So let me show you the ones that I chose. Let me show you the ones that I got. I got three of these. And I got two of these. I wanted five pillows in total. The main color in my um, guest room slash office is white. But there's also some gray and gold as well. So this is perfect. Perfect. I'm happy. A couple other things that I got while I was in there. I grabbed some candles. They were on sale. 25% off. Um, I got an umbrella. I should have been grabbed an umbrella. I should have been had that. Um, so it's nice outside and it's going to be nice for the next couple days, but there is rain in the forecast. And what's the last thing that I got? I got a, oh, I got regular pillows. I needed regular pillows for my day bed. Um, I didn't have that yet. So I need that for whenever I have company. I want whoever is over to sleep, you know, to sleep comfortably. So that's it. So now it's back to the house. I got to get back to these orders. Um, I want to have everything shipped out by tomorrow. So everybody that placed orders this week, I want to have everything out by Saturday. So I'm about to go home, get to work and yeah, put on a podcast and just knock these orders out. So thank you. Shout out to everybody that supported my business. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. What's up, y'all? Today is Saturday, May 6th. It's about 2.30 in the afternoon um, and I'm about to go to Target I got to go get some ink. Y'all, I was in a good rhythm over here, knocking these orders out down to the last like 30, 40 orders. And I ran out of ink. So I got to go get some ink. Um, this printer has been giving me hell, actually. So anyways, I wanted to just show y'all kind of what it looks like um, behind the scenes from a business standpoint. You know, when I have my drops, it's stuff everywhere. It always looks like this. So I wanted to bring y'all along and actually, actually show you what it looks like and how it always is. So uh, let me turn the camera around and show y'all what is going on here in my office space. This is what my office looks like. Um, so like I mentioned, there's a lot of stuff always going on stuff everywhere whenever I have a drop and I'm processing orders. So these boxes got to be broken down. These have already been broken down um, and I've taken a bunch of boxes outside. Um, so these are the boxes that the seasonings come in. These are the boxes. Um, this box is full of orders that are ready to ship. These are ready to ship, ready to ship as well. You need to throw that in the trash, but I'll always just kind of toss it to the side. Um, those are like the tabs, the tabs that are on the poly mailers. I got to pull a tab off. Um, so I just toss it to the side. So I got to throw that away. Um, I wanted to pull this box out to also just talk about how, you know, things don't just always go as planned. And that's in every part of life. And that also applies to business. So this box is going to be um, a box I'm going to add to my personal stash because most of the box is damaged. Um, my products are usually never damaged. I've never experienced this before. And it's not from my manufacturer. It's from the person or the company 
that transported the seasonings. Um, so it's not all of them, but like I said, I feel like most of them. Let me see, hold up. Yeah, like this is all banged up. Um, all banged up like that. And I would never sell anything like this. Like I would never sell my product looking like this with a box all banged up or you know like that's not cool so yeah um so yeah so i have those to the side that'll be a part of my personal stash um this printer has been a headache it has been a complete headache and i you know i looked at a few printers before i decided on this one and what's also interesting so i got it from amazon i thought it was brand new but it's actually refurbished and I don't even think there's anything wrong with refurbished electronics because um, they go through a process to make sure they're good before they resell them. So this is what a HP uh, 4152E and it's just been a headache. It has been. I had issues um, connecting to the Wi-Fi, but there were no problems with my Wi-Fi. Um, it, it was one particular order that he got obsessed with and he kept on reprinting it over and over again. I kept on hitting cancel. It kept on reprinting this person's name over and over again. And I'm like, what is going on? And what I don't like about it, I've only ever had HP printers and it ran out of ink really fast. So that's why I'm about to go to Target now because I'm like, I need to get this stuff done. Um, so yeah, so this, this, I'm either going to send it back. I'm probably going to send it back. If they want to send me another one, maybe I can see if another one is a good fit. I might get a refund. I don't know. But I want to get through these orders and then get rid of that thing. So uh, working off of a laptop, like I said, I'm used to working off of a desktop. So this is a little different for me, but getting through. Uh, this is my setup. So I have, you know, on my desk, I have one of each at all times. So I have a Cajun, a jalapeno and an all purpose. And then right below me. Um, I keep three at a time so that, you know, when one runs out, I can just grab it and keep on going because I like to get into a rhythm and, you know, just get stuff done. So I just wanted to show you all what it's looking like in here. Um, I'm going to run this errand real quick and come back and, and finish processing these orders. All right, y'all. So I have an update. It is 445. So I went to Target and I bought the um, printer cartridge. And surprisingly, I only bought one thing. I just went and got the cartridge and came right back to the house. I didn't buy nothing else at Target, which is an accomplishment within itself. So I get home, put in the printer cartridge. We rocking and we rolling. I'm, I'm in a rhythm. I'm getting stuff done, getting stuff done. Now, I don't know what this thing is doing. It's updating. The app is out of sync with it. Um, it's just it's all, it's just lights flashing on it right now. I have no idea what's going on. And then when it would print... It was printing old labels that had already been printed, you know. So I'm about to um I just put my shoes on to go back to Target so I can buy a brand new printer and I'm gonna send this back to Amazon. This is ridiculous. They need to throw this shit away. Like I hope that nobody else gets this printer because it needs to go in the trash. So yeah, so that's what I'm about to go do. And because my thing is like I was like, I'm getting these orders done today. It has to be done today. I don't care how long it takes me to get it done. I am not stopping until all of these orders are packed up. So I'm about to go do that, find a printer, bring it back, get it set up. And yeah, so I just want to let y'all know that like, you know, things just don't go as planned. It's frustrating, but there's always a solution. There was always a solution for sure. And it's like, I can keep on wasting time with this printer or I can just go find a solution, which is to go get a printer so I can reach my goal, which is to get these packages done today. So off to Target. Off to Target we go.
so I got an HP printer. Um, there were a couple HP options and a Canon option. I thought about Canon, but only reason why I ended up going with this H. So this HP and the Canon that was available, they had the same kind of reviews. They both had four star ratings, the same amount of ratings. And I chose the HP because ultimately I've always had success with HPs. Like I've always had an HP printer. Um, so this was, I think was just an exception. Um, and then also I chose this too, because the HP, um, the printer cartridges are easier to find and they're more affordable. The Canon cartridges are like, they're a lot. They're like double the price of one cartridge for HP. So I didn't like that, but HPs are really hard to find. I mean, easy to find the, um, the cartridges. So I'm gonna go with this, I'm gonna go get it set up and I'll let y'all know how it goes. A quick update on the printer two thumbs up everything was smooth i got my orders done and i'm relieved i can breathe y'all this would have drove me up a wall if i would have went to sleep without these orders being done so i'm all set what's up y'all what's going on today is sunday may 7th it is 6 12 p.m um today has been a pretty chill day i've chilled i've napped i ate good earlier um and I, I wanted to relax because yesterday was so hectic with the printer, the packages and everything going on. So um, I'm feeling good. I feel rested. My energy is back up and I spent time with my honey earlier. So I'm back home and it is time for me to work on this project that I've been putting off. So I need to repot this plant. Um, I'm gonna turn the camera around in a second so y'all can see. So I got this plant like two weeks ago from Lowe's and I want to transfer it into a bigger pot. So I had to get some soil. I don't know if I have enough soil though, y'all. And if I don't, I'm going to go back to Lowe's and give me some soil because I want to be done with this. All right, so let me show you what I got going on. All right, so here's what's going on. Got my potting mix down here. And this is my beautiful plant, Rocket. And I named her Rocket because Rocket was the first baby name that I ever fell in love with. So it was only right. Um, I talk to Rocket every day, y'all. And I also found like these plant playlists on Spotify. So I play music for her every day too. <laughs> um, so yeah, I'm not sure. So I couldn't remember how big this pot was, y'all. So I felt like two big bags was going to be too much. So I got a big bag and a small bag. But I might have just really needed two of these. But I'm going to see. I'm going to go ahead and see if, if I'm going to have to go back. To me, it looks like I'm going to have to go back, but maybe I'm wrong. So I'm going to go ahead and see and just go from there. So I'm all done. Rocket has officially been replanted and that didn't even take that long. It was very relaxing. And you know what this took me back to? This took me back to my second job, y'all. It made me miss getting my hands dirty. I used to work at a nursery and I just knew so much information about plants, trees, flowers, everything. So yeah, it made me really miss that. So I had fun doing that. And my estimate worked out. So I didn't even use the entire bag of potty mix. So I'm happy about that. Didn't make too much of a mess, wasn't too bad. Little dirt here, little dirt here. That'll be an easy cleanup. All right, y'all, so that's it. We've reached the end of the vlog. If you enjoyed the video, please be sure to give it a big thumbs up. And if you're watching and you haven't subscribed, I don't know what you're waiting for. Hit that subscribe button and come join the GP fam. Thank y'all so much for watching. Make the best of the day. Be good to yourself. Peace. I be beaming, I be booming down that block. Down that block. Everywhere you